Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuveer. In this class, we will do some practice on string slicing. In our last class, when we discussed about strings and their methods, there we had an understanding about what string slicing means. Here, we will do some practice examples because uh, we use the concept of string slicing much when we do the coding. Uh, so, in order to get better understanding of slicing, we we'll do some practice. Let's take an example and do the practice. Uh, string is equal to hello learning monkey this is the string which we considered and in our last class we discussed that the indexing starts from zero zero is index first index second index third index fourth index each character is assigned an index so on this is how the indexing will be assigned and negative indexing will also be assigned minus one minus two so from back they have given the negative index we can access any way from the back or from the front we can access by using string slicing so we are taking string length here length of the string print a string of this is the syntax for slicing uh, here we have we are having three parts what's the first part is a starting value we have to give the starting position index value and the second value is a ending position ending index value and the third one is a step count how how we have to jump we have to take two steps we have to take five steps we have to take single step that is what step count is the third point is a step count so here we have mentioned that we have to take step count and the starting index is 0th index and the ending index is ninth one so it will take up to eighth position ending index value is not considered before that it will it will end before that means it will take values 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 up to 8 okay this is how it will it it works so now what's the output it will display here 0 0 it means h will be displayed step count 2 means leave one go to next one l will be displayed leave one go to next one o will be displayed this is how the step count will work uh, if you take a uh, step count is equal to 5 it will jump 5 steps that is how the step count value is uh, mentioned uh, coming to the next example print string of uh, if you did not mention the ending position here the starting position is mentioned and the step count is mentioned and the ending position is not mentioned if you did not mention the ending position it will automatically consider the end of the string till end it will consider that is how it will work uh, okay and uh, the coming to the next one print string of sixth position to end of the position so it is displaying from sixth position to end of the position but step count is two that's why it is displaying like this it is leaving one and uh, displaying the next one coming to the next one if you did not mention the starting position and ending position it will automatically consider it as a starting position is zero ending position is a last one that is how it will consider it will defaultly consider the entire string that is so but the step count is two coming to the next one this is the one you have to understand if you give the negative step count uh, what it mean is it will consider from the back uh, string uh, the string will be considered from the ending position to starting position means it will display here we did not mention here it mentioned as minus one means take from the end to the starting here they did not mention they did not mention the starting and ending position so by default it will consider from end to start it will display the string in the reverse order so that's why it is displaying the string in the reverse order this is very very important to understand so minus one if you give it as minus two it will take the in the reverse order but it will take a step count of two so coming to the next example print string of uh, the same can be mentioned using string of here in the starting portion it's mentioned as a string length string length means uh, the end the end value is the starting position uh, from there it will move towards the start that is the end position this is the starting position so from start to end here it is reversing here the starting position means uh, end of the string ending position means beginning of the string because we are moving towards uh, back to front so that is how it will work and when we have mentioned the step count is equal to minus 2 see here it's very important when we are taking negative indexing this is also important point you have to understand when we are taking negative indexing it will start from the end position it will start from the end of the string that's why the starting position is minus 1 from there the ending position is minus 8 so minus 1 to minus 8 but step count is 2 that is how it will work so print a string of uh, see here we did not take the negative indexing means by default it will take positive index of step count of one 
so that's why the index reversed we are moving towards this side what's the starting index minus 8 what's the ending index minus 1 so this is the difference you have to understand that's why it is displaying from minus 8 means g2 minus 1 means the last position so it won't consider the last position that's why it is not displaying the y value monkey ke y is not displayed if you did not if you mention only one value in the string slicing what it mean is just take the character that is present in that index position that is what single value means string of 8 means 8th position we are having a value that is what it will display hope you understand the concepts of string slicing if you have any questions regarding the concept please post your questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates thank you